Okay guys, so I'm going to do a quick video on, and I hope you can see my screen, but I'm going to do a quick video on um, adding products to your Bonanza store. Um, and I am, let me double check to make sure that this thing is recording, but yeah, it looks like it's recording. So I'm um, sorry for the background noise, stay at home mom with kids, so um, hopefully you'll understand that. But I'm doing a video today about adding products to Bonanza. So it's very, very easy to do. It's two ways that you can actually do it. One way of doing it is um, actually take using a spreadsheet to import items. Um, you can also automatically import items from your Amazon and your eBay account, which is the easy way. But let's say you have like a Shopify store or a small online boutique and you also want to add items from there to your store you can either do it by um, CSV like an import which is kind of difficult with like changing columns um, and getting the columns to fit to line up with Bonanza's you know standard way but um, if you just want to add products manually this is what you need to do so you're gonna log into your Bonanza account you're gonna see this when you first log in you're going to go up to the top, and I'm sorry that my video doesn't show the all, all the way at the top, but at the top left it says selling. You go down to add or edit items. Very simple. You go in, and it should show the items if you have any inside of your booth, inside of your selling booth. You click, literally click on the plus sign, which says add an item. So what I did was I opened up my store, and my um on one of my online stores and what i want to do is start adding products from my online store um to bonanza so um you want to double check and make sure that none of your items are already there on the store because i know with my shop some of what's in my shopify store is also um in my bonanza shop as well but what I want to do is just start adding items. I'm not going to add, however, any free plus shipping items into my Bonanza store. Only regular um, price items is stuff that I'm actually going to be adding. So let's start with this um, LED outdoor fishing camping headlight, okay? So it's literally going to be as simple as, of course, you want to save all your pictures to your computer. You're just going to copy your title. Here we go. Okay, and this is a little over, but um, you're going to add your photos. So, just going to go over here and whatever way that you like to save photos. Let me see if this will work here. No, it won't. So, uh, my photos on here won't. They won't get enlarged, which isn't good. They're small here. So what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to use my snipping tool to... I'm just going to use my snipping tool to grab these photos out of here um, for my Bonanza shop. So let's see. My fishing light. One... I'm gonna grab my next one. I didn't mean to close that. Grab my next image. And there are lots of ways to save images, but on my particular <laughs> store here, you can't really make the pictures bigger, which is something I'm probably gonna change when we get off of here. So fishing light two, and then I'm gonna get my third one. Uh, and I just keep making it hard on myself by closing this thing. But get my third one, and save it. Fishing light three. I'm going to and you can actually save the images behind different keywords in the title 
um, but right now I'm just using fishing light but you can um, actually when you're saving pictures you can actually for one picture do like outdoor fishing um, the next one can be camping hunting clip on the next one can be bright headlights so you can save these pictures with different names according to like the keywords for the um, item um, So here's my next one okay so I'm just gonna use like these four um, just gonna use these four here for you put the pillow down put it down so I'm gonna use these four mm -mm. stop And then I'm going to go over to Bonanza and I'm going to actually um, put these images in. Uh, you can drag them in. If you can do, if you have the capability to do that, you can drag them or you can just upload them. So here are all of my pictures. I'm going to put them all in. And order them the way I had them. So that's going to be your main photo. Um, you know, whatever. Let's see. Okay. And then from there, I'm going to title. Okay, and then from here, you can either select Let Us Guess Your Category, if you want to, and it will guess it for you. Sporting goods, flashlights, like I'm just going to pick the first one they suggest and then submit it. Um, from here, it's just going to ask for like your UPC number. Um, I don't know. Let me see if they make you do this. I'm selecting Unbranded. It's new. Um, don't need to select the country of manufacture or anything like that. I'm going to put my quantity to 10. Um, and then I'm just going to copy and paste my description. You know, right in here. Just this part of it. I'm going to paste in. And if UPC codes are needed, um, those can literally be purchased from um, eBay or um, whoever you're working for can provide the UPC codes for you if this is for, if this video is going for VA. Um, and that is pretty much it. From there, if the shipping is going to be free, you can just select free and then just say like, um, you're just going to do economy, hey, hey, you're just going to do economy shipping um, or, or standard shipping. I would just say economy shipping. Um, if there are any other options because some items in my store take from 10 to 15 business days so um you know i would just say like choose the one with the greatest shipping time which looks like it's economy shipping um and if you want to add shipping you can add it here uh, be careful you can add it here either flat rate or other types okay so it says you I'm, I'm gonna keep it on I will not ship outside of the US because I'm not going to send these items outside of um, US and then from here we're just going to put the items price by going back to our listing I have it priced at $16.99 so that's where I'm gonna price it and then they have this instant offer price we're not going to do that we're just going to keep it at $16.99 
Um, and then from here, we're just going to click add item to your booth. Okay, and from there, the item will be added to the booth. So basically, I don't want any of my free items to be added. Um, I normally don't add free items to Bonanza. You just want to add items um, that are um, have a cost associated with them. So now they're telling you that now this is um, added to your booth. And it's now visible to buyers. And if you click update booth, it should show up now in the booth for sale. Okay, so once you do that, you're just going to literally just go to the next item. And there's my item that I just added. So the process is just basically that simple to add items um, to Bonanza. And that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching.